Around the world tonight into an awful scene, a deadly stampede, hundreds killed on a sacred day in a sacred place. Outside the holy city of Mecca, millions making a pilgrimage on one of the holiest days of the year for Muslims. Tonight, the death toll rising, more than 700 dead, more than 800 injured. ABC's Alex Marquardt reporting in from the region. They were Muslim faithful from around the world, crushed to death just outside Islam's holiest city of Mecca. More than 700 lost their lives, making it the deadliest tragedy there in 25 years. In the aftermath, lifeless bodies lining the streets, covered in white sheets. And another 800 were injured, including two Americans, among the more than two million who make the annual pilgrimage. Witnesses say today's stampede began when two huge waves of pilgrims converged in the Valley of Mina, at one of the sites that all pilgrims have to file through in a single day. One man saying people were climbing over one another just to breathe. This comes less than two weeks after another disaster, a crane collapse that left over 100 dead. Stampedes in Mecca are all too common. The biggest in 1990, when more than 1,400 people were trampled. The last major one in 2006, when 360 were killed. Saudi Arabia's top health official says the stampede was likely caused by pilgrims who ignored instructions from the authorities. But the criticism is growing tonight over the country's repeated inability to safely control large crowds.